On behalf of Holstein Quebec, it's with great pleasure that we present to you Suntour Holstein's Master Reader 2014. This has been a family effort over the years, but I'd like to uh, congratulate my son Kevin for being part of the, the new shield. As soon as you walk into the barn at Suntor Holsteins, one immediately feels the passion that exists for this beautiful Holstein cow, which is either black or red or a few times now pulled. It's a friendly welcome from Fred with numerous anecdotes and personal experiences as a breeder that capture our attention, as well as Kevin's dedication to everyday hard work. It is certainly that passion and determination that led them to their second achievement. I'm very elated to be going to receive our second Master Breeder Award. Uh, it's, uh, I have my own philosophies, but Holstein Canada confirmed it, which is very nice. <laughs> and uh, of the very good and excellent cows, 70% uh, of the cows have qualified for the points, which is, uh, I think, very good. And it's just a reflection of our breeding program. Since their last Master Breeder title, the farm has expanded from 32 to 70 kilos of quota. The herd counts 55 cows and 110 head in total with the replacement heifers. Suntor can be proud to count 8 to 10 very good or excellent dams in their pedigrees. The average milk production is slightly above 1,200 kilos and the herd classification reveals 6 excellent, 29 very good and 20 good plus. The light shoot type cow is a cow that uh is able to score very good or maybe even excellent in the future, last many, many lactations, give lots of milk easily, eat lots of forages, lots of high protein, high fat, um, low somatic cell and breeds back easily. Uh, with the cows that we have had, we've tried to identify them and through use of embryo transfer, flush them uh, quite often in the past and um, try to replicate what we have and what's worked. And uh, with an edge generation, we've been able to uh, find more females to work with and it's with good cow families and find the cows that make them make good profit for us in, in terms of milk production and longevity that seems to have been a good uh, good success for us. It is precisely these types of cows that contributed to this second master breeder title. The predominant family cementing this award is Suntor Aeroline Joy Excellent 5E 13 Stars and her progeny. According to Kevin, you only raise these types of cows once in a lifetime. Joy was also the first excellent cow of the Suntor breeding. In eight lactations, she managed to produce just over 143,000 kilos of milk. She also proved to transmit longevity as several of her daughters have lifetime production records exceeding 100,000 kilos of milk. Joy is certainly the definition of star brood cow. She celebrated her many success stories before she passed on her 15th birthday. Among the most popular daughters of Joy, we can appreciate Suntor Lightning Jellica, excellent 93 3E 7 stars. She proves to be just as prolific as her dam, counting two excellent and 11 very good daughters. She continues to follow in Joy's footsteps, producing just over 102,000 kilos of milk in only five lactations and obtaining three superior lactations. Today at Suntor Holsteins, the Sumborgs enjoy working with two of her daughters, Suntor Alexander Jewell and Suntor Ashlar Jura. Jura, for her part, produced at the age of one year and 10 months, 11,211 kilos of milk, and is classified excellent 94 for her mammary system. Of the same family, there are also two full sisters issued from a split embryo, Joan and Jean, have proven highly efficient in both production and classification. Suntor Igniter Joan classified Excellent 91 7E 1 star and produced just over 125,000 kilos of milk in her lifetime. Suntor Igniter Jean Excellent 91 5E produced meanwhile a total of 88,472 kilos of milk and was sold to Ferme La Fougère. 
Another family that the Sumborgs have enjoyed working with is the animals descending from a purchase of the first Craigcrest herd dispersal, Craigcrest igniter Ruxetta, descendant of another favorite, Suntor Income Rox, excellent 93 3E 3 stars. Rox completes the 10th very good or excellent generation from the Roxy family, a family of balanced cows. Cows from this family are individuals that stand the test of time, cows with a functional type that have superior width of chest and rump and are high producers. Rox has produced over a lifetime 115,859 kilos of milk and obtained a superior lactation. We can't forget to mention Suntor Manoman Jelena, very good 86 two year old, one of the best young cows to have calved yet in the Suntor herd. Jelena was coveted not only for her pedigree but also her very promising GLPI. She was later sold in the 2012 sale of stars for an amount of $30,000. Among her progeny, we find Suntor Joyride, who reached the top of the GPA LPI bull list in April 2013. Uh, it means quite a bit that uh, it's not just milking cows, it's our job, our profession and it's uh, a lot of dedication we put into it every day, uh, many many hours per day like everybody else does and to have great results like this and to be awarded for uh, what you love doing, it's a great accomplishment and it's a very humbling experience. Not only has this year been a year of business transfer, but also a year of recognition, a result of intergenerational collective efforts. Sincere congratulations to the Sumborg family!